Yeah, when I uh, went to Harvard, then uh, Dale was teaching there, and uh, he saved my bacon because I got in there a couple of months late and everything. But he got me in and nurtured me, and uh, th then uh, that summer we went up to uh, to uh, Kylie's place and he introduced me to Kylie and so on. So I got a job there working with Kylie for that summer and the next summer. I was so impressed with Kylie and his rustic uh, way of living and this uh, office was in a ski shop, uh, a ski loft you might say above a barn and uh, it was infested with fleas I remember and we, uh, anyhow. He had a big pot-bellied stove, and my job first thing in the morning was to get there and take all of the mail, the junk mail that had come the day before, and start the fire, get that place warmed up. You see, it's Franconia Notch. But uh, Kylie had been preaching, everything is so simple. Design, life, everything is so simple, simple. So the first project he gives me is to design this uh, complicated, water fountain uh, fountain for a Dr. Benjamin Fine in Philadelphia. I remember it to this day. I had no idea of how to design a fountain. <laughs> Complicated plumbing and pumps and everything. Life is, design is so simple, you know, design this for <laughs> A big project, I don't know what happened to it, was uh, I think it was uh, Kitimat, Alaska. It was it like a new town they were doing because of uh, aluminum smelting or something there? I don't know what happened to that. One project I remember working on with him, which I thought was a wonderful project, was uh, for an architect, Oscar Stoneroff, whom I never met, but I would have long conversations with him and uh, telephone and. Uh, it was a friend's self-help housing in Philadelphia where they would take a block and put all these, uh, take all the backyard fences down and, and make a common space out of the backyard, a real garden for everyone. I was there when Kevin Roach called and I wanted to talk about designing this atrium garden in the Ford, uh, is that Ford Foundation? Yeah. Core 10 building, you know. Yeah, I, I remember those conversations. And <laughs> Kylie finally just said over the phone, I'm on the other line, and, and Kevin is saying, you know, it, we'll have ozone, we'll, we'll it, it'll work, Dan, it'll work. We can have a New England forest in this building. And Dan is scratching his head, you know, and finally Dan says, yeah, but Kevin, is it going to thunder and lightning in there? <laughs> oh, boy. Anyhow, that was a great experience working there. Yeah.